Welcome back to my channel, Mathematics. A really interesting challenge today, too. And inside parentheses, we have 1 plus 2 times 2. Maybe the easiest challenge you've ever seen. Everyone can easily solve it in like 20 seconds. But in the same way, a lot of students make this common mistake. A lot of students solve this question absolutely wrong. So in this video, let's test our brain. Let's solve this question together. So four options A, B, and C, and D. Yeah, so right now, choose one option. What do you think is a correct answer to this challenge? And write your option down into the comment section, okay? So here's our challenge. I just want to rewrite it. So we have 2 and we have 1 plus 2 times 2. Okay? If you look closely, we have a lot of mass operations. Right here, before parentheses, we have multiplication, yeah? Right here, we have we have addition, yeah? Right here, we have uh, multiplication, yeah? So we have three operations. Addition, multiplication, and division. addition, yeah? So uh, multiplication, addition, and one small multiplication. And right now, maybe the main thing, what is the correct order to do this problem, okay? So should we multiply it first, or add, or multiply right here? So a lot of combination, because we can start with addition, then multiplication, and then multiplication, or multiplication first, multiplication second, and... Um, Finally, addition, so a lot of combination. But in math, we can't solve our challenges randomly. We should know what is the correct order to do this problem. Because obviously, whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, okay? So for this challenge, let's look, for example, at this PAMDAS order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. All internet libraries, scientific graphing calculator works according to this PAMDAS order of operation. How does this PAMDAS works. If parentheses is the highest priority, then exponent, then we should evaluate multiplication division group and the last step addition and subtraction group. Okay, so right now in this, let's separate this uh, case. So right now let's rewrite this challenge and let's solve this challenge according to PAMDAS order of operation. Okay, so 1 plus 2 times 2. Okay, let's go through the steps. So what elements do we have in our challenge? We have parentheses, we have right here multiplication, so it's great. We can easily find these elements right here. So right now, let's go in the perspective of this PAMDAS, okay? So first step according to this PAMDAS order of operation is parentheses. So parentheses has the highest priority. So right now, we should scan where do we have these parentheses in our challenge. So parentheses we have right here, okay? So we should start from these parentheses. But a really interesting moment because inside these parentheses, we don't have like a complicated we don't have like an easy expression we have a complicated expression with addition and multiplication okay so right now let's find what is the first step addition or multiplication uh, of course uh, let's look for this let's look for uh, this pandas order of operation okay so we have addition we have multiplication let's find where do we have addition multiplication addition we have right here Multiplication we have right here. So obviously multiplication have the higher priority than addition, okay? So first we should evaluate this multiplication. We should multiply 2 times 2, okay? So we have 2. Inside parentheses we still leave this expression. So 1 plus 2 times 2 gives us 4, okay? So this is our looks like a second step after this finding this parenthesis. So 2 times 2 is our is our second step because multiplication have the higher priority. Uh, multiplication has the higher priority than addition. And inside parenthesis we have multiplication and addition. So we should start from this multiplication, okay? So 1 plus 4, which gives us obviously right here 5. So right here we don't need our order of operation, yeah? Obviously we don't have exponent, we don't have division, we don't have subtraction, but right now you don't need this order of operation because very basic multiplication right here. We have 1 plus, 1 plus 4 gives us right here, we have 1 plus 4 gives us 5, yeah? And we have 2 times 1 plus 4 gives us, gives us 5, okay? And the answer is, the answer is 10. And this is a really tricky moment because, as you can see, it happened that we don't have this option right here, but I give 100% that uh, 10 is a correct answer to this challenge. I don't know why, why we don't have this option right here, but uh, just trust me, option uh, 10 is absolutely correct answer to this to this challenge. Multiplication first, 2 times 2 gives us 4, and 4 plus 1 gives us 5, and 5 times 2 gives us gives us 10. So the correct answer is 10. Let's write it. I don't know why we don't have this option right here, but it happens sometimes. This is like a, um, you can, we should fix this test right here. So we have option, we have 10 is a correct answer to this challenge. So it happens sometimes. But just trust me, 10 is a correct answer to this challenge. So thank you for your time. Have a great day. See you in the next videos. And also write your suggestion down into the comment section. What do you think is a correct solution to this challenge? What do you think about your approach? And thank you for your time. Have a great day. See you in the next videos.